And here we are in North London. Tottenham Hotspur have made the short journey to the Emirates, ready to face their old rivals, Arsenal. I'm Derek Ray, and joining me for commentary is Stuart Robson. Stuart, always something special this occasion. Well, it certainly is. They say this stadium lacks atmosphere, but not today. Just listen to that noise. This is going to be a really feisty affair, you have to say. Potentially riveting 90 minutes in front of us. Tottenham Hotspur with the kickoff. Here are the starters for Arsenal. Aaron Ramsdale is the goalkeeper. Granit Xhaka plays alongside Thomas Partey in the centre of midfield. And they line up with just the one striker looking to do a bit of damage. Can he take advantage? And it's come off the keeper. Oh, the post denied him. It's gone in! Arsenal take the lead in the derby! And just listen to the fans! That tells you the story! Well, as you can see here, the initial attempt is good, but his reaction is brilliant. He was so alert there. So the ball is rolling again. That should shake up Spurs a bit. And running it back. Possession changing hands. Poibier. It's been aimed towards Hyung Min Son here. Fine cross into the middle. No nonsense clearance. Partey. It's with Erdogan. Arsenal pushing forward with options available. Is it going to be? That is a tackle and a half. And Spurs showing good width. Harry Kane. Will it be Harry Kane? Oh, a save right out of the top drawer. Super stop. Crossing possibilities. Oh, he's left his marker for dead. And how well the keeper did. Well, that's just exceptional. He reacted so quickly there. Who can he pick out? Not quite spot on with that one. And an astute piece of defending. Just the challenge that was required. Son. Well, it looked highly promising, but they got nothing out of it. A good and fair challenge. Dejan Kulusevski. Beautifully disguised ball. It's a weighted pass. Well, the clearance half-hearted. And I think the threat has been averted. Arsenal move it forward with purpose and control. And credit is due for that good piece of defending. And space here on the flank. 
Emerson. Kane. Shot attempted. Superb block. Must score! Great reflex action. Well, that should have been a goal. Mind you, it's a brilliant save. And there's the delivery. Just far too close to the goalkeeper. As you can see, Arsenal are seeing less of the ball, but they've certainly shown an ability to counter-attack when they win it back. I expect more of the same. I think it's been a really good performance from them so far. Harry Kane. It's with Bentancur. It might be. Fantastic work to thwart the danger. Saka. And a fine tackle. Harry Kane. He made it look simple, really. Well, the counter chance looks very real. Well, so many possibilities, but it didn't happen for them. Kane. Well, they want that equaliser, but the passing remains smooth. Sessegnon. Son! And a goal here for Tottenham, who have evened things up. Well, as you can see, it was a fairly simple finish in the end, but you still have to be in the right place, keep your composure and finish it off, and that's exactly what he did. So underway again, following the goal that made things level. Committed challenge. And the emphasis is on creativity. He's in here. Oh, a superb save. Saka. No danger here as he runs at them. One minute of stoppage time has been added on. Determined defending. Can he give them the lead? And that is defending of the highest order. That is that for the first half here. We certainly have got to give this man high marks for his work up to this point, Stuart. Well, they weren't at their best, but with that equaliser, you can see why he's so important to this team. Hopefully they can get more of the ball to him in the second half so he can show us his ability. So they get the ball rolling in the second half. Even Steven here. So little to choose between the sides. Thomas. Gabriel Martinelli. How about the cross? Partey. And here's Xhaka. This looks interesting. The end product just wasn't there. Hoybier. Bentancur. And that pass could be troublesome. Kane! And in! Exactly what they were hoping to produce. They've delivered the goal. Well, it's a goal you'd expect him to score, but he kept his cool and he put it away nicely. He'll be happy with that. So back underway at 2-1. Tight contest here. So a throw in here. Thomas. 
Martin Erdegaard. Granit Xhaka. Not getting anxious when they have the ball. Oh, but they've lost it now. Marcinelli. Thomas now. Martin Odegaard. Now Romero with it. Fine sequence of passes. So a half an hour remaining. Given away by Tottenham. Message for Xavier Vicente from the near future. Kane. And Xavier, can you please go back and meet Kulusevsky. Chance here. And a goal to increase their advantage to two overall. That little bit of a cushion. Now it's all about keeping the concentration. Well, we can take another look now. It's wonderful interplay between the two of them to start the move. But when he shoots, I expected him to go across the goalkeeper. He should never beat the goalkeeper inside that near post. That's not good keeping. So they get the ball moving again. 3-1 the scoreline here. What's going to happen next? White. Saka. Ben White. Wonderful challenge and a throw in coming up. Spurs to make a personnel switch now. Thomas. And he takes it on. And it's in! This game very much back on as a contest. Well, here's the replay, and just look at that power. That's almost unstoppable. That's a great strike. On they go again, and that goal for Arsenal means they can now entertain thoughts of perhaps drawing level. Winks. Kulusevsky. This is looking threatening. He could pick out a teammate. Struggling to get it away. Oh, what's he gone and done? And a goal here! Well, it took a definite nick, and nothing the keeper could do about it whatsoever. Well, when you see this again, the defending just isn't good enough. The clearance doesn't get enough height on it, doesn't get enough distance on it, and suddenly the ball's being played back into their danger area, and they don't reorganise themselves, and that's why the ball's in the back of their net. So the current scoreline, 4-2. Granit Xhaka at the ready. A very effective clearance. Good technique displayed. Xhaka. An effective challenge. Well, nearing the end of this one, and Arsenal a long way from their best. Well, they've been second best, that's for sure. And the main problem has been in midfield, where they've been overrun at times. They just haven't been able to get enough possession. It's not been a good performance today. Still not clear. And I think the threat has been averted. It is to be a throw-in. Winks. Getting forward. He cuts it back. And he's fired it against the post.
Chance to play it in. What a genuine opportunity, but it was squandered. Goal kick. And a change for Spurs at this juncture. White. Saka. Xhaka, determined defending. Xhaka, Saka, and they need to get tighter here. Having won the ball back, they might be able to profit. Could be troublesome. Martinelli, just couldn't capitalise there. There will be three minutes added on at the end. Emerson. Now Harry Kane. And that pass could be troublesome. And Son is in. Son with the pass, but not what he had in mind. Martin Odegaard. Bukayo Saka. And options in the centre. Has a go. And fired against the crossbar. So the final whistle now. And disappointment for Arsenal, you've got to say. A defeat for them. Your assessment? Well, Derek, I thought it was a subpar performance from them. Just didn't look as sharp as normal. And I don't think they deserved anything from the game. They need to get a better performance in next time out. I think it's accurate to say, Stuart, that this man was the light bringer for his side. Well, what more could you ask for? His build-up play was clever, his movement was dynamic, and he scored a couple of goals. What a player he is.